All right, so real quick before I show you my station, I'll just give you guys a look around of the shop. This is my barbershop here in Edmonton, Alberta. So yeah, you come in through this door, got fake plants, got 10 stations. And then yeah, just ignore the tripod. We got the waiting area, got the front desk. And then back here, we got the break room and then two sinks and the washroom. But now let's take a look at my station. Guess we could start with, you know, I try to keep it super minimal. Um, obviously when I start cutting hair, stuff gets, gets uh, messy and stuff gets thrown around everywhere. But usually this is how I like to start my day. Um, let's open this drawer. So this is the main drawer that I want to keep super minimalist. Um, I just have one charger. I like to tie it up, tie it up and then hook it on this hook so that there's no wires. I only have one wire hanging, which is um, the Dyson one. Oh, now it got unplugged. But yeah, we got magic clips. I only have one charger because when I use one, I have one charge like that. I got my shears. I have the Hanzo's texturizing shears. Usually the whole barbershop borrows these. I barely even see these in my station. I barely use them too. I just use my one shears, Hanzo's six inch. They're the HH6. These are like $1,200 shears, but if you have questions on those, let me know. Everything will be down below in the description. Also, everything that I say, there's a link down there, skit.co. Um, that link is affiliate link, so that means if you buy something from it, I do make a little bit of a percentage. But anything from there is just the same price as Amazon. Um, I got the finally fresh guards. I bought these like five years ago. They're beat up, but I like how they feel. When I cut with them, it, it's got that sound. It's just different, the 0.5 and the 1. These are the only three guards that I like to have here because anything above it, I just clip over comb or I just flick or I freehand. Then I got my feeding brush. And then usually I have my comb here, which is right now in my barber side. But this tester is just, um, um, I was just testing it out. Usually it's in that jar over there where we have the, all those kits. Let's open this one. So this one might be a little bit more messy than the other one. I have my blow dryer here and then my styling brush. Neck duster, I usually have it on top. I just have my backup shaver, um, just for like around the ears and sideburns when I do tapers. And then all my long guards up top here. I have like a camera flash, just random stuff. Got my Rogaine, got my um, beard roller for my beard, you know, growing in soon. After shave, and this is a duster for the clippers. Then got my blades here because I have my blade here. So I just change them here, put my dirty blades in there, back there. And then, um, yeah, this is just some beard stuff that I'm trying out. I don't know if it's really working, but uh, yeah, just random stuff. And then these are my other essentials. So my styling comb, clipper over comb, comb and um, cutting comb. So for sectioning and stuff, I use this. I use this for my shaping and this is for styling. So I usually have this here and these two in my essential um, drawer. And then that's it. On top, we have obviously um, barber side or cool care, barber side, my water spray, blade, um, disinfectant spray and powder. And then on that side, you can't forget about these. I have my detailers. I just need one. Um, they're good for balding, good for um, lineups. I usually just, um, just charge it whenever it doesn't die on me. And then have the bronze series nine. And yeah, I legit, I could do like 20 haircuts with this setup right here. I like to be minimalist, especially with my front, with my um, 
my front desk or my countertop. So when the client sits down, they can easily see themselves. There's no stuff, um, you know, blocking their view. So pretend you're the client right there. Yeah, and when I, I try to keep this close because it is the messier one. And then I just have these three guards, my brush and my comb. But yeah, other useful things that you could get, let's go take a look at um, eBlend's station because he does have the 245 charging mat. Let's take a look. Oh, he gave it to Juso? Oh, never mind. Never mind. It's gone now, but let's compare my station with this guy's station. So, as you, as you can see, um, wires everywhere. <laughs> Just kidding. He's got um, two clippers, two trimmers, shaver. Another, another clipper here. And then he's got the case there. I don't know. Same with Arthur. He's got Gatorade, Tim's. This guy's exposing his barber, dude. You know. Let's see, barber, let's see Pat's, though, you know? You know what it is. You know, Pat, he's, uh, he's on the camera right now. You know, management <laughs> got to be better, but. So. He's got the JRL joints. I like that. You know what it is. Um, I, I did try them out, but I don't know. I still like my Magic Clips. I don't know. I just like to stick to my roots. I don't like changing stuff up too much, but he does like them. He still has the Magic Clips uh, trimmers, uh, Hanzo shears, guards, and then he's got a styling brush, like round brush, this, and then Dyson. You know. Not bad too, but yeah, what my main goal is trying to get rid of stuff. What I'm actually going to do is just get rid of anything that I don't use at all. If I don't use it at all and oh, and this too, sorry. Um, this is usually not on my station, but um, I, I did buy it. Um, enhancements, I just use Kiss Express with alcohol, but I was using 245, but we ran out. Right now, shipping is so expensive with them, and we had extra Kiss Express. So, if if I want to put it on Instagram, make it a little bit more crispy, use that enhancement. But yeah, what else? Ring lights usually just there because of the backdrop. They like to take pictures through there. That's not my ring light. Um, I can turn the sensitivity up of this light pretty high, and then we do have those track lights up there. Show. Them. Um, those track lights are kind of useless, but it helps a little bit. And then for products, I just go to the cart. I just go to the cart here, wherever it is. And then I just use whatever product I need. This is kind of an idea we had. Instead of having so many products everywhere, just put them all in the middle. Everybody just go grab it.